Hey guys, what's up and welcome to a brand new video and in this one I'm going to be seeing some mates that I haven't seen in a while and we're going to be going downtown and finding some abandoned buildings and these buildings we're going to be trying to get in, I've never been in before so it should be really good for the video we won't like certainly get into them, I'm not sure if we can get in yet, I don't know if there's a way in these ones I've never been able to get into so yeah we'll give it our best shot but yeah either way we're going to make a great video today, we're going to have loads of fun so yeah let's go <laughs> about to go into is an old sign factory. Woolen Signs was first established in 1883 by Edwin Woolen. Then in 2008 after 125 years the site finally closed down. This is a great building to go around but it is very unstable at some point so if you are going to go here you're going to need to be careful. But yeah that's it for the few facts let's get into the exploring. Nice. All right, well, I'll see you soon. I really hope I don't fall through because I am on my own. Oh my god, that's not stable. Oh my god, that's not stable. Oh. Actually feels like I'm about to fall through. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm in. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm in. I've just had to climb on this dodgy windowsill. It's all moving, look at this. Not good. But yeah, at least I'm in. Pigeons everywhere. Usual for an abandoned building, I suppose. But yeah, let's have a look around. Oh my god. That pigeon's going crazy. What's this? There's lots of bird poop in here. There's paint over there. What's through here? Some stairs leading down. I hate pigeons, they can fly into you, they're proper clumsy and yeah they just like, they always make you jump see what I mean, they always make me jump <laughs> there's all these like stickers on the wall cool so yeah this was a sign factory I don't really know too much about sign factories but this is one there's a ladder going to the roof here should we have a look now or later? I'm kind of thinking now, but it doesn't seem very stable. Let's have a look on the outside. Yeah, that doesn't look stable, but we'll do it anyway because I'm an idiot. <laughs> There's also a way down there. I prefer going up and down on the outside because I just sort of know where I am a little bit better. So yeah, let's go up. Yeah, this would have been like the sign along the top. I don't want to walk too far on this because it really just does not seem solid. I don't think I'm going to go any further than that just because it's not worth it. But yeah, you can see the sign from here. You can see the courthouse. I wonder how many people can see me. Probably quite a few. <laughs> to be fair, this ladder's solid. It's just a bit awkward to climb with a torch and camera in your hand. <laughs> I've just been hit quite hard in the face by a plant. <laughs> What's over here? This looks like somewhere I might be able to get through. So overgrown, I don't want to scratch my lens up. God, it was not easy climbing through that. But look at this. This is interesting. 
That looks like an old record player kind of thing. Don't know if it is, but it looks like one. And yeah, there's all paint everywhere. Obviously, they'll be putting things on the signs, so yeah, they'll probably need a lot of paint. Just smells of paint in here as well, you know, because it's all been left open. Look at that. That looks like nice paint, doesn't it? Some paint's been spilt here a long time ago, and there's like little drips. I don't know if you can see them. So there's a little drip somewhere. It's just sort of dried. I don't know how that works, but yeah, obviously it's a thing. I really don't like exploring on my own though, guys, because I don't know what to expect in this place. A bit random. <laughs> That's quite cool graffiti, yeah. Little dog face. More paint. There's just paint stacked up everywhere. Have a look up these stairs, see if they lead back to where we were. Yeah, the stairs just lead back to where we were. I never had a look in this room. Okay, take it all in. <laughs> I don't really know how much I want to explore, do you know, while I'm here on my own. I've ripped my coat a little bit as well, climbing through all those bushes, which I'm not happy about. I think I'm going to have to go back onto that horrible ladder full of bushes and stuff, try and get somewhere else. Oh, guys, I've cut my wrist open. That's not good. I'm going to have to go back to those. I don't want to be walking in here like that. That's not good. I might have to come back to this place. I hope that's going to be all right. It's bleeding quite a bit. Hopefully it'll be fine. I'm going to have to get out though. Oh. Let's see if there's a way out over here because I don't want to go back the way I went before. This is an actual used building so hopefully there's no one in here listening to me tap about. Let's go to the top. Oh, it's a bit slippy on here. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to go down that way. This is not safe whatsoever. These are slippy as well. Hopefully this ledge here isn't too slippy. Yeah it is. I'm just gonna have to jump this, take the height drop. Oh I'm getting all blood on my Hugo boss top. Look, I'm literally dripping blood, guys. Look at that. That's a big drop. That is a right mess. I've got all blood down my arm. Not good. Yeah? Wait, right, there's a slight problem. What? I was climbing through and I've cut like my wrist a little bit. I, it's so... It's not like fully on my wrist, it's sort of like in between my wrist and my hand, but yeah, I'm gonna need to get it cleaned up. Uh, keep walking round down where the courthouse is, I'll meet you at courthouse. Right. Alright, I'll see you in a minute. I'll see you in a minute. Alright, we're just heading to McDonald's now, it's just down there. Yeah, I'm gonna go and get cleaned up because that's not good. And then, yeah, we'll probably keep on exploring as long as it don't keep bleeding. I don't know where my mate's gone. One's waiting outside and there's one somewhere down there.
blood leading to the staircase. At this point security were right underneath me, then a few seconds later they looked straight up and saw me, so I decided it would be a good idea to get out of there. But at this point I decided I didn't care about the security, so I kept on climbing and I decided to climb the biggest one. So yeah, let's do this.
downstairs and I heard security proper rushing up the stairs. So I switched to GoPro and I just ran straight out and decided to climb down on the outside. Well guys, I managed to get away with that. I honestly, I saw some security. I was going down the stairs, I had to put my flashlight on, and I saw security running up at me. So I had to run out, climb back down the scaffolding, and I probably sped it up, I don't know what I'm gonna do in editing yet, but I don't I don't know how to describe how fast I went down that scaffolding. I've never gone down scaffolding that fast in my life. God, I literally, I can't believe it and I'm about to get run over. But yeah, that was so much fun climbing to the top of there. I could barely stand on top of it with that windy. My God. I can't believe I kept on climbing though when security came. Okay guys, after that I ended up doing something even more crazy. So yeah, that's going to be part one. Part two is going to come very soon. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, remember to leave a like and remember to subscribe if you're new. Also remember to leave a comment because I love comments. So yeah, that's it for me and I'll see you all in the next one.